Welcome back to Designing Online Instruction in Moodle. Today we're going to learn how to add a book resource to your Moodle course. You first need to turn your editing on, scroll down to the section that you want to add the book, drop down on your add a resource and select book. You're going to give your book a name. Mine is going to be called Books in Moodle. And the summary is important because that gives the student information about the contents of the book. And you would probably want more text than I have here, but this is just an example. Chapter numbering can be done by numbers. None. You can add your own chapter title. I'm going to set, stay with numbers. And the bullets and the indents are for the subchapters. I'm going to save and display. Do not save and return to course in this case because you're not finished editing your book. So select save and display. And now we're going to start with our first chapter. And our first chapter is going to be called Intro to Book. And I would type my content here. And I'm going to save changes. And you can see that this is what the student will see. The title, Intro to Books. It's chapter one, and this is the content that I typed in. Now, I want to add another chapter to my book so that I will be able to present more information to the student. So over here on the left, you have your table of contents, and you can add another chapter by clicking on the plus. And this is chapter two. I'll name my getting started with book. And I'm going to save changes. And there's my second chapter. If I want to add another, I click on add a new chapter. This time I'm going to make it a subchapter so we can see what that looks like. And my subchapter is going to be called adding content. And that would be something that your subchapter should fit underneath one of your chapter headings. I'm going to save my changes, and this time you'll notice it, it's underneath the 2, and it's 2.1. Now, I have over here on my table of contents the titles to all my chapters and my subchapters. I can move these up and down with the arrows. I can edit if I need to make changes. I can delete, or I can add another chapter. I can hide and unhide. Students will be able to scroll through your book using the arrows. So this will take them back to the previous page. And that's how they would navigate within books. Books are a great way to present information in Moodle.